Hi, I'm Karen. We're here at Montevilla Sewing Center, and today we're talking about the Janome HD 1000. In this video, I'm going to give you an overview of the machine. To start out with, this is where you plug in both your foot control and your power cord in one plug. And behind that is the power switch. Here we have the hand wheel, and inside is a stop motion dial that you use when you are winding your bobbin. Here we have the bobbin winder spindle. We have two spool pins, normally you just use one. This is the handle for carrying your machine. Over here is a guide for winding your bobbin. Then we he here we have the take up lever and that's the part that goes up and down when you're sewing and then we have thread guides. Here we have the dial for uh, regulating the tension on your top thread. Over here we have a thread cutter, so when you're all done, you can just cut your threads right there. This is a um, needle threader, so it's really a nice feature on this machine. And then you have a quick release for your feet, so you can change feet uh, on your machine, this quick release lever back there. Then here we have the needle plate and the feed dogs. Then we also have the accessory tray. The accessory tray looks like this. And you can take this off and you have a free arm. The free arm is great for doing jeans, hems, and things like that where you're sewing in the round. Down here is where you put your bobbin in. Over here is where you can lower your feed dogs. And I'm going to show you how that works. So push this to the right, it lowers the feed dogs. And now you can do things like free motion quilting or thread painting, things like that. To put it back up, I'm going to put it back to the left and then roll my hand wheel one turn and that makes the feed dogs re-engage. Um, we'll close that back up, put this back on here like this. And then to put your presser foot back on, you just match up the, the hole in the presser foot with the hole in the needle plate like that and lower your uh, presser foot. Now the presser foot lifter handle is right back here. You can lift it up a little higher if you need to. Up here you have your stitch chart. Now most of the time you're probably going to want to be stitching straight stitch. That's B right here. So this is your stitch selector dial which corresponds to these stitches here. This is your stitch length dial and this is the reverse lever right here. So that's the Janome HD 1000. I hope you found this video to be helpful and if you have give us a thumbs up and if you have comments or questions you can leave those in the area down below. We have lots of other videos on this machine and on other machines here on our Montevilla YouTube channel so stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Bye.